one. Hello, I'm Mortal Spin Nights, Property Delivery, and we are in Cantalave. Hi. Yeah. You gotta get Dennis out of the party. Why? Did, wait, did we beat Bryson already? Uh, yeah, we beat him. Yeah, we beat, uh, we, Byron already. Oh, I didn't know that. I forgot. Yep. It's been like a week. Or two. Uh, yeah, I'm putting Duchess back in, getting Susie back out. Because Susie has really earned the place in the party. <laughs> she has. What, you don't think Duchess has either? Uh, Duchess was just there because that way we had something to, to block steel type decks. If that makes any sense. I am ashamed that you don't think Duchess has uh, earned her spot in this party. Remember all the good times we had with Duchess? Like, the time we caught her? And it costed, <laughs> like, 20 Ultra Balls? Yeah, it took a while. Uh, I'm also going to put Aura Calcum in the party with a Soothe Bell. Equipped. Why would you do something so stupid? Yeah. She, he's level 1. Why would we need to use him? Duchess is the only fighting type we need. <laughs> she doesn't even have any fighting moves. She doesn't even have any steel moves. We taught her Iron Tail. Why would, he te why would we teach her something that never hits? Because she's the only one that we ever teach it to. Holy shit, no, that's too loud. Yeah, that's what you get. <laughs> Trying to fix the volume. And in the library? Where we find out that, you know, Pop <laughs> Tor can't read. Oh, yeah. Look at uh, this place. What? Actually, Why aren't there videos? Actually, no. He's a speed reader. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I already read all the books in here before. by the time you got here. It's like, well, we've been here for a while. No, uh, it was before we fought on the bridge I read all the books. <laughs> yeah. I just reread them. This is like the fifth time. How did you read all that? Yes. I can read three books a book. <laughs> He's about to run off and Rowan's like, no. So the evolution of Pokemon, more I study, more mysteries appear, blah, blah, blah. Now, we're going to split you all into three groups. Dodd, you're the weakest, so you go to that one next, so a bunch of level four Pokemon. I need to send the strongest. <laughs> that's, not, that's not yet, that's not yet. Until That's not talking to the explosion. I mean, what explosion? Yeah. Okay, here we go. We need to split up into three groups. Don, you're the worst one, so you go to the place with a bunch of level threes. Now I need to send the strongest one to, you know, Snow Point City. Hop Tour. No, I need you to go. No, I need to send the fastest one to the furthest one away, so Hop Tour. And main, a... and main character, you have to go to the one that has plot at it right now. Hop Tour's like, I'm already there, but you're right here. This is my, this is my after image. How can you still talk with it? Uh... Hoptor Sprite just disappears from reality. <laughs> oh, come on, he's not that fast. <laughs> the Red Bull disagrees. You mean his blood? Yeah. He was gonna make us go... Dawn, you go to Lake Verity. I need to send my strongest to Lake Verity. I'll go myself. Yeah. Well, if that uh, one comic has anything to say about it. <laughs> yeah, that comic was amazing. Yeah. Is Rowan the oldest professor? Uh, I think he might be. It's, it's between him and Oak is the oldest, and I think Rowan's older. By like 10 years. I remember teaching Oak. Damn up, start. How can you forget if I... the one you're looking at is a boy or a girl? I mean, there, there's some of those out there, but... 
Both cases, you know which gender everyone is. But didn't you ask me which one I was at the beginning of the game? Shut up. Uh, it's not that I asked which gender you were, I asked which gender you were going to be. Because little do you know, I I've also performed sex surgeries. <laughs> oh my god. Doom! Oh no, plot! It, you know, it's weird. We hear that bomb across, the, you know, across, uh... Yeah, you hear it across the, the region, and yet it only does, like... It gets rid of the water and kills the Magikarp. Yeah. You see, here's the thing. Can you just imagine if you were in a town, like, that was, like, only 50 feet from that lake? Yeah, don't worry. Veilstone's fine. Yeah, Veilstone, um... Pastoria. Starting Town, and, you know, Snow Point. Well, They're not, fine! No, no, it's, it's, it's only like Valor that exploded. Uh... Just... That's stupid. Y you go to the desk, Hey, did you guys hear a bomb? Did you know Parisa Chu is my favorite? <laughs> of course. Like, did you not hear that bomb? I like ice cream! Of course. I wish in every there should every be aftershocks. Nintendo game. There, there's not aftershocks though. Yeah, I know. I wish in uh, every Nintendo game there's just that one guy when you find him, he's just like I am error. Uh, it's all, that's that's actually that was his name. His his name was Error. Yeah. <laughs> hey, old dude and kids, did you hear? Get in my van. <laughs> I'm just kidding. It's a boat. It's funny how, like, that bomb shakes the library across the, co you know, across the region, across the ocean. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it is on an entirely separate island. Yeah. Like, if you were to look at the map, it is on its, like, like own island. Did they even need to use the bomb? I'm pretty sure a canoe would have cost less. <laughs> a small bomb. Boat probably would have taken less scientific ingenuity. You know, I would fly then. there, but I want to get happiness up on the real loop. Yeah, so run. Yeah. yeah propels. So uh, I'm going to cut when we. I'm going to cut to when we get to Pastoria. Yeah. So. All right. So on the way back. So on the way to Pastoria, I ran into a Pokemon Ranger we hadn't fought yet, Cody. Why? Because I forgot to. It's raining, so I guess Susie. Um, there's, uh, there's two trainers I know you forgot to fight. Oh, I forgot to fight all of those, uh, fishermen. No, I'm talking about there's two people in go that ghost tower. I'm not going back to fight those. Well, I might now because I'm se because I'm severely over leveled over them. I just don't like doing double battles, Cody. You want to hear my least favorite grass type, Carnivine? You know, I would argue with you, but it has no redeeming qualities. Yeah. I mean, name another bad grass type, and I, I can argue why they're better than Carnivine. Yeah, I'm, I'm not going to do that, because we'd be here for a while. You want to hear... It's not the best grass type, but you can hear one of my favorites that isn't one of the womenly ones, because they're adorable and actually decent, and I don't know how to, like, team sweet dragons with, uh, like, Lilligant and even Serena to a point. Those okay. are my favorite grass types. Snover! And a bomb of snow. But doesn't the ice type make them have the most weaknesses in the world? Yes, but their snow warning makes Blizzard hit every time. And uh, remember that one Nuzlocke that everything oh, I had yeah. was weak to flying? That was like my only counter to flying. Because of Blizzard. Because so, of Mega Obama Snow. So we're in Pastoria, and on the way here, I stopped by this shard house to see if Orcalcum could learn any moves. And he could, 
And it's a vacuum wave. So, <laughs> you know the vacuum wave. You have to get a priority stab. Yeah. It's like uh, quick attack, but better. Yeah. And it's a special attack, which is unheard of, really, for priority moves. Hey, there's vacuum wave. Yes, there's vacuum wave. N until Gen 7, name me another special priority move. Uh, there's another one. There is. But it was it was physical in Gen 6, but that in Gen 7 they turned it special. So I am unsure. Uh, Water Shuriken. Oh yeah, they did! I never think that's a priority move, mainly because it's also a multi-hit move. Oh yeah. And now it goes off Greninja's best offense. Best off offense. Yeah. Are you ha are you friendly? <laughs> uh No, he's not friendly yet. Okay. Anyways, You're Lake not... Valor. What was that, Cody? You're not friendly. Oh, I'm not friendly. But I taught him a move and everything. Do I have any vitamins vitamins actually? Yeah, you walked across the region with him. You'd think you guys would be best friends by now. Ooh, I have a calcium for him, Cody. Throw the zinc on it as well, just to give, you know, give it more. Actually, I think I'm going to give the zinc to uh, Butch, so Butch can survive more, because Butch is kind of our tank. Okay. PPFs, I save those. Gotta save those PPFs. Because <laughs> you never know what's gonna die. Which it's is, true. Which is why we were so hesitant in teaching Angel Earthquake. You know, in our luck, she would have died immediately in the next battle. Yeah. But now don't she worry. has it. Next gen, we don't have to be hesitant about TMs. That is true. I like how when you find the key for that woman, she gives you a cookie. Oh, yeah. But you need, like, a... Rock climb. I couldn't think of the HM. Wait, do you? I thought it was, like, somewhere where you didn't oh, need Oh, yeah. Rock. That's right. I'm thinking of something else. I'm thinking there's two items next to her. So, Team Galactic, we've got to go up front. Uh, I think Firebutt, or whatever we named him. F Fire yeah. Firestorm? I mean, yeah. he soloed the entire last gym, except for the leader's last two things. Angel but, needs love, then. Yeah, I'm about to say, because uh, Firestorm got an entire debut episode. The closest stop is Twinleaf. Fuck you, asshole. Please let me catch it. Toss a Pokeball. That should work. Oh, yeah. You know, the, I thought that, you know, in Gen 2, when you got to the town with the, all the slow pokes out, I actually uh, bought, like, 10 Pokeballs and kept on tossing and thinking that would work right next to it. <laughs> I was, like, six. Okay, Glamio. What are we? Using? In theory, it would it should have worked. Yeah, in theory, not in practice, unfortunately. Glamio, Cody, what are we doing? Ah, uh, we're slashing it. So we're using slash. Or we're using dragon claw. Slash. Are you, are you sure? Yeah, there's no need to use. It's going to use fake out anyway. Wow, it didn't use fake out anyways. <laughs> but that was programmed into their blood. What do you think this is, Gen 5? Yes! Uh, so... Slash crit already. This episode, this episode? Alright. Murkrow, we keeping Angel in or are we switching out? We're keeping Angel in. What can a Murkrow do to a dragon? I... <laughs> it uses Ice Shard. Crits. 
Yeah. See, look at that. Cyrus's uh, Sneasel, when we fought him in Silesic Town, did have Ice Punch, by the way. I don't know if I ever said that on camera. Wow, slash crit two times in one battle. Consecutively. Wow, things are looking up. Well, if you remember, Cody, in this game, our party has had obscenely high crit rates. Lurgon is the crit master. I have used for a magic harp. We don't need a shitty water type. Hey, Gyarados is decent. It's a shitty water type. It's decent. It learns no good physical water move except for Aqua Tail, and that's still like Waterfall. low accuracy. Unless, yeah, if you have it. Which you some, don't, yeah. some games don't have Waterfall as a TM. Uh, yeah, I'm saying keep... Gyarados is too hyped out, up to be, uh, it's too hyped for what it can actually do. Remember, you know, the games canonically all act like it's Hyper Beam, you know, is the shit. So apparently there is one Pokedex entry that is 100% canon. Guess Which what? One? Guess what Pokemon it's for. I'll, I'll give you, I'll, I'll narrow it down, it's from Gen 1. Magikarp? It is for Machamp. What does it say about Machamp? That it can punch a thousand times in two seconds. How's Machamp garbage then? I don't know. That is like the most anime move. Uh, Golbat. What do you think? Earthquake. It's yeah. super effective. But it's also immune to it, so clearly that counts a lot out and makes it neutral. Yeah. I say Dragon Claw. I actually go with Slash. See if we can get the three for Yeah, see if we can get a three for. Are you sure she doesn't have the scope? Uh, I can I I don't know what she has actually. No wait, she has a dragon fang, so that dra so Dragon Claw actually does more damage. Okay, just do that then, because we've seen how sl how much Slash did. Yeah. See, that's that is the thing about uh, the Crobat line, is that they're actually pretty tanky. Yeah. For, for how fast they are. They're just aerial ace. We don't want to miss somehow. <laughs> we don't want to miss somehow. Well, there's the somehow, Cody. Damn it, Angel. I can't switch, so I gotta heal. What if I used heal block? That would suck. <laughs> that would be all the bad. I don't remember if Cutter is the high crit one or if it's the uh, flinch one. Cutter's the high crit one, uh, Slash is the flinch one. Come on, Angel, it has no health left. There we go. You just, you just had to slap yourself in the face twice. She had um, origin issues. She couldn't remember where she was at where she was from at the moment. Remember, some uh, Roselia knocked her off a cloud. Oh, yeah. Well, I mean, I remember that, but that's, that's clearly she what did. happened. Let's put someone else up front now. Well, let's throw Susie up front. Why not, right? Yeah. It's the worst that Galactic could have. Well, Golbat. <laughs> not that though, that's that's fine. Oh no, it sucker punched us, Cody. Whatever will Susie do? 
die. Well, no, as soon as he barely took any damage. Hey, she got a level. Hound hour. That's, that's another bad thing for us. Angel or Magnum Opus? Ah, uh, shoot hour. this guy. Shoot him and his bitch. <laughs> now let's see if the Hound Hour is actually female or not. Why would it, it be? It is male. Still a bitch. Dunky. He only has one weakness, Cody. And that weakness is death. Well, that's everything's weakness. It, that's adorable. I thought we were going to use protect or something, Cody. Yeah, faint isn't good until Gen 5, then even at Gen 5 it still isn't good. Yeah, Faint's just not good, but it gets significantly better in Gen 5. Glammeow. If I can keep Angel in. Yeah. Slash it. I was going to use Dragon Claw because it's significantly stronger. But what if there's a bo uh, actually I don't think there's really a boss until like not uh I don't think there's one until like ver like until like Verity we might fight the one here we might not I don't think we do for now though oh right Firestorm still has the exp share on that's why nothing is getting experience right now ooh lava plume. He better than Fire Punch. Yeah. Because sometimes you'll want to burn everything. But I forgot he still had the uh, EXP share on, so... Yeah, let me get rid of that. Do I have anything that increases the power of fire or dark? Hey, uh, since we're actually that close after this little event, take, uh, let's take a work out from the Velstone City. Okay, that's fine. That is a thing we can definitely do. And let a, let a, uh, strange woman touch him. I mean, obviously. That's how he makes us love us. That's how we make him love us. Of course. Okay, so do we want to put sunglasses or a plate on uh, our f on Firestorm? Because either they think either way, it does the same thing. Well, you're giving him glasses. Uh, does he look hungry to you? All right, we'll give it. <laughs> we'll give Firestorm sunglasses. By the way, Firestorm can also learn psychic if we want to try to buy that again. Okay. And just to check, there is nothing over here. And nothing down there. There should have been at least one item. <laughs> but, it makes, yeah. but it makes sense that there's not because after you do this and you don't pick it up, you it'll miss out on that item. So if it was like something like, say, a potion or a Pokeball, then fine. Master Ball. <laughs> oh, no. I mean, in some games, you... Uh, like, Gen 3, you can totally miss the Master Ball. Oh, yeah. If you don't know where you're going. Gen 4, I can't remember when you get the Master Ball. Uh, Are you giving it? Uh, Cyrus gives it to you. Oh. Why well, is it usually you find it in the enemy place? I don't know. Okay, yeah, we did have to fight him. 
Gen 1, you're given to it after you're running off Giovanni. Gen 2... I... Th Elm actually gives it to you. Yeah. Gen 3, you find it in, like, Aqua Magma Base, whatever. You're, whichever one you're playing. Gen 4, the cult leader gives it to you. Gen 5, from then on, it's just like... Th Here uh, you go, my friend! And Gen 5, Juniper gives it to you after you beat the 8th gem. Yeah. Like, Gen hey, you six. beat all eight gems. Here, have a Master Ball. You Gen are, 6, you you're, giving, you're giving it to it after, uh... I think of uh, the Pokeball guy, um, you know. Yeah, the the one who the in the Pokeball manufacturer in the Pokeball factory is one where you get that one. Uh, the one thing that pissed me off the most, I only want the big nugget. Ser Serena can have my uh Master Ball. I don't need that shit. I got Quick Balls. No, nope. and he's like, nope, have one of both. Yeah, and he looks at Serena. You get nothing, bitch. Okay, so we're confused and we're toxic. But this, this? Is, but this is Ice Beam. <laughs> I'm going to try it one more time, and if that doesn't work, I'm switching. I hope, uh, no crit, no crit. Oh, God. Ice Beam! Is this Cyrus, or is this like... This is just, this is Saturn. Oh, okay, I wasn't paying attention to who uh, we're fighting. Are you kidding me? You say no. Guns in danger. <laughs> yeah. Okay, who are we switching in? Uh, Firestorm is probably our safest bet. That or Angel. Yeah. <laughs> if it used Toxic or or Confuse Ray, or Calico could one shot it, but I'm not gonna risk that. It's too dumb. I think Angel against a Golbat. See, that would just demolished Orichalcum. Yeah, there wouldn't even be Orichalcum left in him. He'd be dead. Yeah, it'd, it'd be corpse. Wouldn't even be corpse. Like we'd go back into our party and then just be five slots because he'd just be in pieces. Yeah, all it'd be left with would be the Soothe Bell. Yeah. Bronzor. It might have Levitate. It might have Levitate. I'm going to switch in Firestorm because that's, that's, that's the safer one to test out. Yeah. I like his animation. He's trying to give the, the opponent a Ooh. kiss. He's like, my lips are puckered up. Flammenwerfer. I would have loved a plume. I can give you this. Oh no. That one had levitate. Oh. I forgot. They don't have an attack stat. They have a special attack stat a, li a little bit. I was like, oh no, rock tube. Oh, rock tube. Uh, Toxicroak. Angel Does or Firestorm Susie? Does Firestorm have Psybeam? Susie. Angel's weak. Yeah. Firestorm does not have Psybeam. Oh. That w that's Magnum Opus. I thought, you know, he also had it. Nope. Look at my claw! It's red! Look at my claw, it's gonna cut you in half. No way, I'm gonna use my wings instead. It's funny though, Toxic Croak is like actually good. It is. Not a lot of people like it. I would love to use a Toxic Croak. Ooh, Poison Jab. Ooh, Poison Jab. Poison Jab's like my favorite poison. We are we're, we're faster. So. I'm it attacking. could have also had Sucker Punch. It could have, that is true. I didn't weigh that option. But it turned out fine. We, we both know I play this game riskier than you do. Yeah, and apparently playing it risky always pays off. 
It usually does for me, actually. I'd probably say if I would have healed, then I would just got critted. Or, you know, switched into something that would have resisted and not been poison, and I would have, you know, it would have been super effective, and I would have been toxic. Of course. I have two antidotes, perfect. Don't want to waste the full heals on just regular poison when it's outside of battle. Yeah. This game is actually kind of lagging right now because of the area we're in. Yeah, there's so many uh, thingies. Yeah. So now we're going to go to... Veilstone and do a massage. But and then we'll, and then next time we will shall travel to Twinleaf and to Lake Verity. That's next time. <laughs>